Ah, winter flying, delays, cancellations, de-icing. Ever wonder what it costs to de-ice an airplane? Well, it depends on the size of the plane and the severity of the weather, but tonight, about 10 grand. But we need it. We're going to Dublin, Ireland. If I had to pick one word to describe Ireland, I couldn't do it. It's got something for everybody, like for you pub hoppers, it's the Temple Bar area. And then again, if you want to just shop, there's Grafton Street. And then the many parks, like St. Stephen's Green, you can just relax. But for the adventurer, hop on the dart and head out of town. 25 minutes north of Dublin is the seaside village of Hoth. Here you leave the hustle and bustle of city life behind and experience Irish life firsthand. And if you want to see that amazing Irish landscape, you've come to the right place. There's a loop tour around Hoth. You kind of walk around the peninsula. It's about 10 kilometers, so bring your shoes and you know bring your fitness. But on this hike, you're going to see some spectacular scenery. Let me show you. Take a last look at the town of Hoth as you head down the narrow but well-marked trail and get ready to be amazed, but be careful. Whoever you hike with on here, you better know them. Because the trail is right up against the cliffs. If there's no guardrails, there's no ropes. So one slip, it's a long way down. If there's one complaint about the hike, is that just when you think it can't get any more beautiful, you turn the corner and prove yourself wrong. I'm all done the hike now, walking back towards town, and I just have one more stop, the bloody stream. Warm and festive, and right next to the train station, the bloody stream is the perfect spot to warm your bones and have a cup of tea or a pint and the best fish and chips ever. There's a little Irish in every one of us, so you don't even need a reason to come to Ireland. Six hours from New York, that's it. So get on a plane, come home.